everyone welcome back again to my channel this is teacher Mars and today's video we will discuss about writing polynomial function in factor form a polynomial function is a function of the form p of x is equals to a sub n x to the power of n plus a sub n minus 1 x to the power of n minus 1 plus a sub n minus 2 x to the power of n minus 2 and so on where a sub n is not equal to 0 the terms of the polynomial may be written in any order however if they are written in decreasing power of x then the polynomial function is in a standard form so before we proceed try to recall the following so we have here the types of special products Square of binomial. This special product results into perfect square trinomial. Example of oh, its formula a plus b squared and its resulting equation is a sub a squared plus 2ab plus b squared as well as its difference a minus b squared. Its resulting is a squared minus 2ab plus b squared. So we have here example. So 2x minus 3 squared. So the value for a is 2x and the value for b is 3. So we have here the x squared would be 2x times 2x is equals to 4x squared and 2ab is 2 times 2 times 3 would be negative 12x plus b squared is 3 times 3 is equals to 9. So that is a square of binomial. We have here another product of sum and difference of two terms. So this results to difference of two squares. So its formula a plus b times a minus b. So it is the product of sum and difference of two terms. So its resulting is a squared minus b squared. So example x plus 2 times x minus 2 would be equals to x times x is equals to x squared and its b is negative positive 2 times negative 2 is equals to negative 4 so the product of sum and difference of two terms of x plus 2 times x minus 2 is equals to x squared minus 4 so another special product is a square of trinomial. This would result to six terms. So a square of trinomial. So a plus b plus c squared. So we have here its formula a is squared plus b squared plus c squared plus 2ab plus 2ac plus 2bc. So example 2x plus 3y plus 4z is squared. So our a is the value for a is 2x and the value for b is 3y and the value for c is 4z. So by substituting the a is squared or 2 times 2x plus 2 times 2x is equals to 4x is squared, the b is squared or 3y times 3y is equals to 9y squared, the c squared or the value for z, c is equals to 4z. So 4z times 4z is equals to 16z squared. So 2 and the value for a and b, 2 times 2x times 3y is equals to 12 x y and 2 a c is equals to 16 a c plus 24 b c so those are square of trinomials so we have here product of binomials 
The result is a general trinomial foil, first, outer, inner, last. Method is usually used. So here is the formula. So A plus B times C plus D. So its resulting equation is AC plus B times BC plus AD plus BD. So we have here an example, X plus 2 times x plus 3 so the value for a is a is x the value for b is 2 and the value for d is 3 and the value for c is x so by substituting we have here x squared plus 2x plus 3x plus 6. So adding similar terms, x is squared. So 2x plus 3x is equals to 5x plus 6. Another is a product of binomial and trinomial. So the result is a sum or difference of two cubes. So we have here a plus b times a squared minus ab plus b squared is equals to a cube plus b cube. So we have here its difference of two cubes, a minus b times a squared plus a b plus b squared. The resulting is a cube minus b cube. And its example, x squared times x squared minus 2x plus 4. So its resulting is x cubed plus 8. So we have here the methods of factoring. So we have here the table, column A, e, method when, when it is possible and its example. So number one, factoring out the greatest common factor. When it is, when is it possible? If each term of the, in the polynomial has a common factor. The example, 2x squared plus 8x. So there is a common factor of both terms, which is 2x. So 2x squared it can be is divisible by 2x and 8x is divisible by 2x. So number two method, the sum product pattern, A to C method. When is it possible? If the polynomial is of the form x squared plus bx plus c and there are factors of c that if added will get b. So example, x squared plus 5x plus 6. So the factors of 6 that if added will get 5 are 2 and 3. So 2 times 3 is equals to 6 and 2 plus 5 is equals to so the resulting is x squared plus 5x plus 6. So its result is x, x plus 2 times x plus 3. So that is the sum product pattern. Number 3, grouping method. So if the polynomial is of the form ax squared plus bx plus c and there are factors of ac, that if added will get B. So steps, split, split up middle term, group the terms, factor out GCFs of each group, factor out the common binomial. So we have here an example, 2x squared plus 9x minus 5. So the factors of AC is 2 times negative 5. So is equals to negative 10 that if added will get 9 or 10 and negative 1 so split up middle term so we have here 2x is squared plus 10x minus x minus 5 so group the terms make make sure the group the terms with common factors so 2x is squared minus 1x plus 10x minus 5 so, grouping the terms. Factor out the GCFs of each group. The next step. So, we have here the result. X times 2X minus 1 plus 5 times 2X minus 1. And factor out, final step, factor out the common binomial. So, 2X minus 1 
times x plus 5. We have here perfect square trinomials. If the first and last terms are perfect squares and the middle term is twice the product of the roots, so we have here example 4x squared plus 12x plus 9. So the first and last terms are perfect. So 4 is a perfect of 2 and 3 is a perfect of 9. Our 9 is a perfect of 3. So the middle term is twice the product of the roots. So 2 times 2x times 2, 3 is equal to 12x. So we have here 2x minus 3 squared. So difference of squares. If the expression represents a difference of 2 squares. So x squared minus 4. So square roots of the terms x squared is x and the square root of 4 is 2. So the resulting is x plus 2 times x minus 2. So we have a writing polynomial function in factored form. So example y is equals to 64x cubed plus 125. So this is the form a cube plus b cube so which is called the sum of cubes factored form of a cube plus b cube is a plus b times a squared minus a b plus b squared so to factor the polynomial function follow the steps below so find a and b so we have here a is 4x and b is 5 substitute the values of a and b in the equation so we have here the substitution and so the factored form is the equation y is equals to 4x plus 5 times x 16 x squared minus 20x plus 25 so that's all for today guys don't forget to subscribe like and watch my videos Thank you everyone. See you in my next video. This is Teacher Morris and believes that everything is simple and lets you make it complicated. Thank you everyone.